Welcome to Philip Highlights, I'm Summer and I'll be serving you the latest news of the week. Your news, our business. With Country Garden missing recent debt payments, investors have raised concern about the recovery in the housing and market and the broader economy. Not only that, July saw a widespread weakening of data in the sector, which can be attributed to the slow revival of domestic consumption, the property downturn and persistence challenges from the global economic environment. The growth rate of retail sales and industrial production decelerated in July, even as traditional offline services were gradually resuming normal operations. Despite recent efforts to relax policies, the property market downturn persisted, leading to reduced demand for loans. However, a different trend was observed in the manufacturing and infrastructure investment sector, which remained relatively stable, supported by structural trends. In view of that, the People's Bank of China lowered the rate on its one-year loans or medium-term lending facilities by 15 basis points to 2.5%. We believe more policy easing is likely and the PBOC is likely to stay accommodative for longer. Back home, the conclusion of six state elections brought about the expected outcome, with PHBN correlation retain the three states, Benin, Selangor and Negeri Sembilan, but with slimmer majority overall, Separately, PN retained Tengganu, Kelantan and Kerda with a significant majority and notably a clean sweep in all of Tengganu's 32 state seats. It also made inroads in Penang and denied the unity government's two-thirds majority in Selangor. Despite this, we believe the unity government can now rule with certainly until the next general election. The immediate priority for the unity government revolved around expediting the implementation on its policy agenda, encompassing reforms and subsidy rationalization. While this year is expected to be more favorable for investment than the previous year, it is important to stay watchful for any market volatility. Play Capital Malaysia provides a comprehensive list of products, including discretionary private managed account and unit trust that offers to retail investors, high net worth individuals, corporations and institutions. Whether you want to DIY, seek for advice, or let the expertise fully handle your portfolio, our platform can cater to your preferred way and needs to achieve your financial goals. That's all for today. Stay tuned for the next Philip Highlights. This update is brought to you by Philip Capital, your partner in finance.